Shalom Akim. First and foremost, I like to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rakakudash, and double honors to the apostles and elders of great millstone that rule well and teach well. It's a sincere salutation to all the Akim out there pushing this truth and sincerity on the highways and byways. Shalom. All right. I'm going to start. So today, you know, I'm going to start off in Revelation 1 and 3, you know, talking about what's going on right now and how we all building up, how it's building up hey, to the mark of the beast, which is the next big prophecy we waiting on, man. Lord, Yahweh, Bashim, Yahweh, Shah, willing. This is it. All right. So Revelation 1 and 3. Blessed is he that read it. And they that hear the words of this prophecy and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. All right. So blessed is he that readeth. All right. So we're so those who are in this truth, all the Akim and the few sisters that's in this truth. All right. Hey, we blessed because we are reading it. All right. We're able to read and understand thanks to the apostles and on down and to the spirit that Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah has given us. All right. To understand. All right, it's had that faith. All right, and they they hear the words of this prophecy. All right, the prophecies just talking about Daniel, Ezekiel, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Revelation. All right, and keep those things which are written therein, for the time is at hand. All right, so the time is the day of the Lord. All right, and then on top of that, the hour of temptation as well. All right. So we, hey, everything that's going on right now with, you know, they closing down, uh, you know, they shutting off borders, uh, putting countries on shut, uh, well, one country just put on martial law. I might do some diligent study into that. Uh, so I might come back with a video on that. Lord willing. Uh, you how about shout willing? All right. So, yeah, but you know, it's a lot of things going down, going down right now, for lack of better words. You know, then the next thing we went on is the mark of the beast. All right. The, R, the RFID chip, man. And I'm telling you, don't take it. All right. So, so one of the things I wanted to get into was uh, Second Ezra chapter 15, verse, and uh, we'll, verse 16. All right. For there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings, kings nor princes, and the and the course of their actions shall stand in their power, right? So basically, like sedition. Let's get into that word real quick. Let's see if we can get definition in. Sedition. Uh, enticement of resistance to an instruction. Against lawful authority, how to use this? Hold on, let me see. Let's see. Let's get into that definition real quick. All right. So, definition of sedition. All right. Ice resist to or insurrection against lawful authority. Basically, like protests, man. All right, up wars of the people. All right, resistance. You know? All right, so it's a video that I really want to pull up real quick before we read this. You know, I'm gonna pull it up real quick. We ain't watch video, but it's into this yellow uh vest that's going on in um France right now. You know, they're going to they are protesting. All right. Again, for the uh, economy, you know, they want more pay and all that. So, let me see, let's see. One second. Come on, that's what I want, right? Yeah, so see, they said the cars on fire, man. You got the old school. Hey, hey, team out. And you like the. Hey, just wait till this come to the man. Babylon 3. Just wait, man. Just wait on me.
Hey, so much for life down out there. <laughs> So I don't mean, okay, no, just wanted to show that. Yeah, close that out. No. But yeah, that's what I want to show, man. They protest, rioting, man, for real. Saying cars on fire. Hey, that's what it's hey. That's this is what the world coming to, man. An end, man. An end of Esau kingdom, man. Rulership, man. Alright. Alright, verse 17. All right, a man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. All right, so now you see what they shutting down, board, closing borders, and putting people under quarantine. Well, now it's voluntary quarantine. Well, soon it's going to be, you know, mandatory quarantine. People got to stay in their house. So really, you won't be able to go anywhere, man. So we won't, won't be able to go to the city, different countries, none of that. You know? All right. And Trump closed the border uh, for the Brit, the British border for thirty uh, flights to uh, Brit, British uh, thirty days. All right, so you know ain't nobody going nowhere, man. They got this place on lockdown. All right, so if they want to push that chip, hey, this be a good time. They got everybody off guard, you know. Fur pen, and you got the some people in pen who don't know what's going on. All right, verse eighteen. For because of their pride, the city shall be troubled. The houses shall be destroyed, and man shall be free. All right? So, you know, America, hey, Babylon, America got a lot of pride. All right? You see how all these cities are troubled. All right? These people don't know what to do. They in derision. All right? Over this over this corona, this corona, COVID-19 virus. All right? So, they trouble. And the houses shall be destroyed, and man shall be afraid. So, we're seeing all that right now. How they, uh, you know, going into the stores, you know, buying up on everything, track up, when ultimately that's going to fail, man. All right? Especially when it comes to Jacob's trouble. All right? In that time, hey, it's just going to be you and your how about you how was shy. All right? Verse 19. A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy their houses with the sword and despoil their goods because of the lack of bread and for great tribulation right because the famine all right so it's going to be a lack of bread due to the famine all right this pestilence that's going on in this skirt that you know eat the wicked uh eat the wicked elite all right is doing to you know stir up fur within the nations all right and everybody going crazy buying food and soon when uh you know it ain't no more food and everybody going crazy like what they gonna eat what they gonna do ain't no man gonna have pity upon his neighbor breaking into the and then destroy their houses all right kill and hey killing them with a sword man with a gun a sword could be a gun man all right and you know you got some people out here who actually would use a sword <laughs> hey but that's just hey it's it just what it is man and that's why if you part if you are a Hebrew Israelite, one of, from other twelve tribes, hey, it's now the time to repent while you still can, man. All right, repent, return to the Most High Yahweh Shimei Hawashah, follow His law, statutes, and commandments. They're not burdensome, man. All right, and spoil their goods because of lack of bread and for great tribulation, right? Because of the famine. All right, you see this pestilence, COVID nineteen, causing people to buy up goods. And you know, it's this uh, let me see, uh, it was this uh video that I was shown, you know, that's been go circulating around the web. You know, how this one, how this woman worked on the dock, and in New York, I, I believe. Correct me if I'm wrong on the comment board. Um, but she uh worked there, and you know, saying how it was, they was low on uh imports. And how there was no food and how the crates would usually be uh stacked like a city building, but now it hey, it's not even that. Alright. So that's so that's what I wanted to grab on that, you know. Alright, so now I want to go uh, you know, into this chip. Alright. Cause that's that's another big prophecy we waiting on, alright? Another one. Alright, so this is about like 
after all that, you know, uh, martial law, you know, mandatory vaccine. This is hey, they might use the uh, vaccine and say that's the microchip. Uh, might say the vaccine is the microchip. Hey, you know, because you know, Trump asked the Walmart, CVS, uh, Walgreens, Target stores to use as a vaccination center. Alright, so I'm going to get into this, Revelation 13 and 16, and he causes all, both great, both small, so like you're both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads, right, so he is wicked, eat, uh, wick, the wicked, Esau, Edom, the world elites, alright, the high class bankers, alright, and they, and they would call the cause, you know, uh, you know, the fortunate to less fortunate, you know, the kids to uh, adults, all right, to the, you know, rich people who got money, to the people who's living on the streets, all right, those who are in jail and those who are out of jail, all right, to receive a mark on their right hand and in their foreheads, right, all right, so the mark of the beast, all right, verse 17. And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark, or the name of the beast, or the number of his name. Alright, so if you don't receive that if you don't receive that mark, you won't buy, you're gonna be able to buy, you're gonna be able to sell. Alright. But if you do, you will be able to buy and sell. But do not take that chip. Alright? And there's a reason. Alright, you will be drinking of the cup of the most high's indignation, man. You will burn with fervent heat. When he lost, and you will eat a missile. Hey, just leave it like that. You will eat a missile if you take that chip. All right, it's better for you to get beheaded and not betray the most high. How about shoot me? I was shot. All right, then to take that. All right, man, you better take. Hey, you better take that beheaded chipfully. You feel me? All right, so I will bring. It's an image that I want to bring up, showing what it look like. You know. All right, so you see right here. Uh, see if I can. Uh, let me see if I can find a bigger picture. I don't know. Let me see real quick. You know, man. Yeah, that's just gonna have to do, man. Alright, let me see. Type in something else real quick. Alright, RFID chip. Alright, so you can see you got multiple, like, you see? What are they, like a penny, quarter, smaller than that. Alright. Let's see if I can find an image real quick, you know, to help. But you see, you got a pretty, like, right there. You know, he got one in his neck. I, I believe that's a neck. Alright. And then you got a picture with one in the hand. See, on the left hand, on the right hand. Even in the forehead. Either way, do not take that chip. Alright. This is the mark of the beast. All right, do not take that chip. All right, do not. Or you again, you gonna be drinking of the cup of the most, the most. How about shim? How was shots? Indignation. All right. So that's you know that's kind of it on that one. All right, but let me get this last pre-sale real quick. All right. So Revelation, four. We gonna start off at Revelation fourteen and nine. Come. Huh. And the third angel followed them, saying with a loud voice, If any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his, in his forehead or in his hand. All right, the beast is, you know, uh, the wicked league of Esau. All right. The national banking families, Rothschilds, Rockefeller. All right, all them. All right. The so-called Illuminati. All right. Again, if any man worship the beast in his image and receive his mark in his hand, in his for so like in his forehead or in his hand, the same shall drink of the wine of the wrath of Yahweh Shimi Hawasha. All right, so you if you take that, you're gonna be drinking of that wine, man. All right, that wine of the wrath, man. And you don't want to drink that, man. Hey, that's gonna lead to your death right there, man. Your damnation. All right. Which is poured out with a mixture into the cup of his indignation. <sighs> hey, look. 
Man, you don't want to take, you don't, hey, you don't want to be in that, you don't want to be in that mixture, man. For real. Hey, do not take that chip. All right, I can't stress it enough, man. All right, and he shall be tormented with fire. All right, going back to them ICBM missiles. All right, and brimstone, brimstone, Salakia, in the presence of the holy angels, in the presence of the Lamb, man. All right, so don't be taking it, or you're going to be, hey, you, the wrath of the indignation. All right, and let me pull that out real quick before I end off on this. All right, this is going to be the last one. All right. I can give a quick Alright, let me see if I can find it real quick. All right, Con Jeremiah 15 and 25. The Lord Yahweh hath opened his armory and hath brought forth the weapons of his indignation. For this is the work of the Most High Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, power of hosts in the land of the Chaldees, man. Esau, man. Esau, man. All right, so them, hey, look, the weapons is the ICBM missiles, man, and that's what you're going to get. All right, if you take that chip, all right, take heed. Do not be stiff neck. All right, return to your house, Bashim Shah, if you are of the 12 tribes of Israel, so called uh, Negroes, African Americans, Hispanics, and Indians. All right, and Native Indians, like you. All right, but you know, I want, uh, Lord willing, brothers was edified. And the sisters out there that's listening, all right. And again, like the Barakatay Yahu, Barakatay Yahu Sha, Barakatay Yahu, Barakatay Yahu Sha, Yahu Ba Hashem, Yahu Sha Ba Hashem Rakakudash. And double honors to the apostles and elders, a great millstone that rule well and teach well. And sincere salutations to all the Akim out there pushing this truth and sincerity. Shalom.